live, the different chat qualities of the stream. Nice. Good to know. I, I remember that being called a thing. I don't remember what it was called, though. I'm gonna get water real quick. Drinks are quiet. I'm ready to play again. I'm gonna see if I can do something. Okay, yeah, I'm, I'm dumb. Alright. I'm just gonna... Actually, is it command? Hang on. There we go. Okay. All right. Okay. I'm ready to play now. Morning, Mr. Morgan. I should. What do I have to do now? Right at this very moment. I was talking about that bounty. I want to go and do that before I do this. Eyes 
should actually get more more stuff. I have I have all my guns that I want. Actually, I wanna. Do that in the in anyway. <laughs> oh. Hey, easy there. Yeah. Yeah, the train's doing. Sorry, John, I'm not doing your mission right now. I have business to... Sense of humor, the fellers around here. How drunk were you? Just normal drunk. Anyway, I should probably hit the breeze. I'll be at camp if you need me. Bye, Lombago. Nice to see a new face in here, mister. Listen, fool or not, that drunk's a friend. I'll see you mess with him again. I'll see to it you don't do much after. Screw your threats. That piece of shit comes around here again, he'll get what's coming to him. Thanks, Commissioner. Good-looking horse there. If you want me mm. to keep that overnight, there's room in the stable. Mm. Okay, that's good. Good saddles is almost as important as a good horse. I got one of them myself. Does this even make any sort of difference to anything? I don't know. Hey, it costs more Probably. for a reason. Always good to have one of those. I'd want to be hollering after a horse with that name. Uh. Oh, here we go. Good. Good. Okay. Or 
morning. Yeah. Welcome back. You got any rooms? Rooms all yours. Head on up. What's a dollar? I think it's this over here. Yeah. Okay, there we go. That's all I wanted to come up here for. This is our man. You a bounty hunter, mister? Maybe. It depends. <sighs> but I'm guessing you ain't here to pass the day, turn yourself in, or discuss the finer points of county law. Then I don't need to know much more than that until I got a reason to. All right. You smell that? This here's a livestock town, mister. Tracks delinquents and reprobates like flies. Now, I'm not a fellow to pass a quick judgment, but I've been around long enough to know you don't hire oh, a dang it. to catch a scent. You bring me what I need, and I'll pay you well, and I won't ask no questions. So, what is it you need? Why don't you have a look at that poster on the wall over there? He's a low-down huckster. And poisoning folks with his miracle cure from here to Ansburg. Killed more than Landon Ricketts without even pulling a trigger. Get some kind of sick satisfaction out of it. The feller over at the saloon says he thought he saw him by the gorge straight north of here. You think you can bring him in? The money's good. I need him alive, though. I want to make sure the women he witted get compensated before he swings. I'll see what I can do. Well, good luck to you. Wonder I don't remember how much money I got paid for that one. And we need him alive. That's an important point. Very important. I got it. I'm gone. Benedict Albright? Oh, sir? Huh. Kinda look like him. And I was told he'd be up here. No, uh, not me, sir. It's because I want to buy some medicine. And I heard, uh, 
her good things. I'll pay in gold if you could help me find him. It's just my mother's real sick. Oh, well, if that's the case, if it's for a sick woman, I'd be happy to help. I'm a healer, you know, a medical man. Finest medicine in the state. <laughs> Trash. Game's over, mister. Put your hands up. Taking you in. Taking me in? What for? Apparently that stuff you're pushing is killing folk. Near the price on your head. I don't know. It ain't my business. Oh, partner, that's crap. I'm a healer. I got an aura. I speak to spirits. I'm a scientist. Folks get real angry for no good reason. <laughs> this... This is a mistake. Keep your hands up, buddy. They only want you for questioning. I have to insist that this is a mistake. Don't be a fool. Oh, right. Hold on. I'm slipping. Uh. Shit. <laughs> oh, 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 you saved me. Now, come on, buddy. Let's make this easy. What, you're taking me in? It's just for question. Oh, hey, you saved my life. Ain't we had enough drama? I, I'd be better off jumping. I, they expressly told me not to kill you. What? Oh, this is about you. <sighs> Don't jump. Oh, 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 what? You can't shoot me. Oh. Please. I'll take my chance. Come here. Uh, bye, friend. Really do not like you. There we go. I really shouldn't have done that. Shit. I got across. Swim to the end. Grab on to something. All right. Look out the rapids. Hold your breath. Don't you dare drown. He's <laughs> going down. <laughs> Come here. Come here. Who made you God, friend? Who made you judge? I'm only in it for the money. That's even worse. <laughs> No problem. If you just don't mind me. Oh my lord! I wasn't expecting you back so soon. Uh, Mrs. Calthorpe was uh, just leaving. Sure. Where you want him? Cell in the back. I have to drop him, or what am I doing? 
Was you offering? Uh, $50. Ooh. Yeah. Thank you. I can buy what I was gonna uh, buy. Uh, please, remember what I told you. Oh, that's a lot of honor for that. Anything in there you need. Put in cell things here. Good doing business with you. No key then. Remember what I was coming in here for. Not Valentine's been not a rough coat. kind of town as long as I can remember. Best. That's mighty popular these days. I'll buy both of these. Got what I need. Okay. Some of the fellers who play poker down at Flat Neck Station said they had some clergymen in. Thanks, partner. Okay, John. I'm gonna do your quest, I guess. So, feeling better? How's the scar? I heal pretty fast. Lucky you. So you just lazing about and you got any leads? Got something. You see them? Sure. Well, you see yourself as a shepherd now. 
Maybe. Come on. Well, where exactly are we going? Collect something. Help us get some sheep. Uh, you know, that attempt to seem all enigmatic and interesting, that might work for Dutch, but for you, it just makes you look stupid. Come along. You'll see. That train job was a start, but we need more money. Until we can get back to Blackwater and collect. I'm here to tell you. We try to collect that money anytime soon, it'll come with a noose. I was worried you'd say that. Dutch says that we... Dutch says a lot. That's his gift. Saying things. Oh, yeah? What do you mean by that? I was the prize pony once. Now I'm the workhorse. Listen, Dutch is... But... But, well... You was at that thing in Blackwater. We already seen Pinkerton's here. New century's coming. This life, this way... Well, we're the last, I reckon. We ain't long for it. Then that's the way it goes, I guess. For me, yes. All right. So where are we going? We just need to pick up something. There's a hitching post over there. Tether the horse and I'll meet you across the street. Uh, I already don't like how this is going. Store. Yep. Boots. Forgot right. boots. Head in, pick up the sniper rifle. Sure. I'll explain later. Oh, well, hello again. How can I help you today? Looking for a rifle? Something with a sight on it. Shouldn't be a problem. You want to see what we've got? It's all in the catalog here. I'm never going to use this. You good? Sure. Let's go. Ruined my holsters. Come on. It's fine. Couldn't you have done that? Done what? Damn. With that gun. Ah, I had a run in with that fella earlier. We ain't on the best of terms. You had a run in. I've had a run in with half that town. Calm down. It's done now, ain't it? Why are you being so cagey about all this? Always playing some goddamn game. Me? I ain't the one taking Jack on fishing trips. No, you ain't. If you say the boy ain't yours, what's the difference? You probably only run off again. Why are you so interested in my life? Ain't you got one of your own? Just do one thing or another. Not be two people at once, that's all I'm saying. It ain't that simple. You know that as well as anyone. <clears throat> Same as with you and that girl. What was her name, Mary? That was different. Hey. <clears throat> no, it ain't. Just to say. Anyway, for the love of God, will you tell me what you got me doing here before I turn around and hit the breeze? There's a herd of sheep coming down to auction from Emerald Ranch. Folk in town were saying the owner's trying to stamp out every farm from here to Ansburg. Yeah, I know that place. up there. Get a proper view. Way, 
So I'm thinking that the herd will make it to auction all right, but a couple of new ranch hands will be collecting on the sale. Doubt the town will care to notice too much. Why we need this rifle you couldn't buy yourself. Reckon we shouldn't get too close. At least not till we know what we're dealing with. Let's see what we can see from up here. That's them over there. The one now. Put a shot in near them. Well, looks like one of them don't scare too easy. Put another shot in close. That ought to do it. All right. Let's go round them up. Let's go get the strays. You ever work on a ranch, Marston? No. You? Oh, day here or there, but not much. Most cowboys I know are dumb as trees. How hard can it be? They're pretty scattered. Let's get them all rounded up. Yeah, yeah! Sheep to me. You ride Shank, keep watch for any trouble. I brought you in on this. It'll be quicker this way. Trust me. This ain't the right time for you to be learning how to hurt. All right, whatever you say. I'm done arguing. is right around that mountain. Okay. Like I said, I'll handle this. Sean, do you mind? Maybe? Like chilling out? Yeah. Now, this is peak red dead. There you go. Literally hurting sheep. John, why? I've seen ones with less ambiguity, 
about their providence? <laughs> a lot less. What are you trying to say? I'm trying to say you give me 25% kickback, and I won't say nothing to nobody. Everything all right here? Excuse me? Sure. I'll excuse you for 25%. Do you want me to put another hole in your head? Folks swing for rustling livestock. 25%. 15. 20. 18. Done. Calm yourself, friend. Just think of it as I'm buying your sins. Uh, you're buying. We're paying. Go on now. Come back after the auction. You'll get your money. Dutch is waiting for us at the store. Yes? I don't, I don't think we ever get that money. I'm gonna be honest. Thought we was doing the robbing here. Still good money. Well, thanks for all the help with this. Can't herd, can't swim. Give it a rest, will you? We ain't kids no more. No, we never really was. Sunshine, I'll buy you a whiskey. Yeah, I don't want that. Lunch. All right, I'm good here. Not everyone, but After in the end, you, sir. I don't believe in absolutes, just shades of gray. Compromises. Compromises. Well, I uh, gentlemen. Dutch, they both. Where have you been? Working. Marston's thing. Good. And? We're just waiting to get some pay. Um, a few sheep. Leopold, my good friend, as long as you're here, why don't you and John go make sure there ain't no funny business? Of course. Gentlemen? Drink? Sure. <clears throat> Nothing like talking to old Strauss to make you want to blow your own brains out. I should have left him where I found him all those years ago, bookish little Austrian, fresh off the boat, his eyes out on stalks. Well, I guess the Dutch Vanderlyn finishing school has some strange graduates. That it does. To your good <clears throat> health. Thank you. All right. Vanderlyn! What the hell? You don't know me, but you keep robbing me. My name is Leviticus Cornwall. I am not a man to be messed with by the likes of you. Get out here before I have these men killed. You see, that's, uh, that's not going to happen. Well, I. You start spinning a yarn. When I think the moment's you right, I'll make a move. Why not? Really looking at the camera. Please, gentlemen, this is a terrible mistake. This is a case. Your mistaken identity. What is worse than admonishing a man for the sins of another who wants to be the Messiah? Not me. No one do I want to be. The Messiah. <laughs> I don't know why I did this. Are you kidding me?
Come on. Okay. Where? I forgot that. Cart. I'm doing it. I'm killing them. Troops and get them to start packing up. Ugh. Sure, we can't stick around after this. Let's go. <laughs> Hungry. <laughs> I'm just gonna eat. Sorry, guys. How is this fair, right? Because it isn't. Is it like glitching out? What is happening?
east. Is that the plan? For now. And when do we stop? When we reach Paris? Well, that'd be nice. Join the commune. We stop when we find someplace sensible. Shake them that's following us and lie low. This is lying low? Turned into a bunch of killers, I mean it. We ain't even got the delusion of being anything but a bunch of killers. So, we moving? Yeah. We are just trying to survive, Hosea. We don't have a choice. This will end soon. <sighs> Damn right it will. Constipated as usual. Micah told me of a place we can lie low. Look here. Dewberry Creek, he said. Okay. Maybe you and Charles can go take a look, clear off anyone you find before the whole lot of us move in looking so conspicuous. And how are we gonna do that? I don't know. Start dancing? Looks like I turned into a goddamn errand boy. You have turned into my son. You worry because I worry. We are just the same. Charles, come with me. We got work to do. Now, where have I heard that before? Oh, they made the mistake of letting me drive this. I think. I think I'm controlling the speed. Really hope I am. I don't want to slow follow Charles. So where are we going? Find a new spot right, there we go. We're packing up and moving on. Again? We have to. Sure. Fast. We'd already pushed our luck too far before that mess we just made at Valentine. Uh. Right there. That didn't sound good. Before you disappeared on me, uh, killed a lot of law. Killed a lot of Cornwalls, man. They must know where we are by now. So, we're heading south? Yeah. Area called Dewberry Creek. Dutch wants us to give it a look. Make sure it's clear and a good place to lie low for a while. I've only known him a few months, but the way he talks, I never thought I'd see him wanting to head south. Right. And I know by now, there ain't no lying low. There's Hello, Diablo. And there ain't no way Dutch is gonna just hide away in a cave somewhere. Goes against everything he stands for. Hello. That'd be admitting we're nothing more than low-down criminals. I'm just playing. Which we are. You don't have to tell me. So where does it end? Where does what end? Literally started streaming like 20 minutes after I woke up. That was like an hour ago. Before, put enough time and distance between you and the problem, eventually it went away. I mean, this is a big country. But now, with these Pinkertons, better paid bounty hunters. Now, hang on a second. I think that must be it up ahead, the old dried up creek. Seems very open. Yeah, it does. Ain't sure to be the best in the rain, neither. Well, let's take a look around. Hey, I see something over there. You see it? And I see something on my map. Yeah. He's been shot. Looks like trouble got here before us. I think I saw a camp <clears throat> up ahead. Let's go take a look. All right. <sighs> All right. Look, here it is. I'm just chilling. So place looks empty. you're good. Let's have a look around and make sure. Enjoy your lurk. I see you in there. Hello. I see you with shotgun. Hi. It's okay. It's okay. 
You can come out of there. You okay? You don't mean no harm. Are you okay? Sprechen Sie Deutsch? Mit German? No. Now go on. Get out of here. Go. We need the land. Go. <laughs> Get the hell out of they here. They took our father. Who did? Men. Last night. Where? Where did they take him? It ain't no business of ours. I don't even speak their language. You are as tough and dense as all that. Come on, Arthur. The girl was pointing this way. Let's see if we can pick up a trail. I see a trail just ahead. Yeah, that's it. Come on. Let's go. <laughs> What's going on with you? What do you mean? You were just going to send that woman and her children on their way? We're wanted, man. We got Pinkertons braiding down our necks. We should be moving camp, not running off. Wow, goose chase. Come on, Arthur. That's not how you are. Well, maybe you don't know me as well as you think you do. Wait, just let me make sure this is right. I think I literally just need to follow him. I don't think I need to do anything. Okay, looks like they go down this way. So. What happened with those Pinkertons anyway? When you were fishing with Jack? Said they were on to us. Offered me freedom if I turned Dutch here. <laughs> they picked the wrong man there. We should have moved right then, if you ask me. Think this is the right way? Give me a second. along the shore here so yeah uh where were we bastards told me they killed mac they said it right in front of jack uh, that kid it's gonna be tough for him yeah turkey tur oh my god looking out for him than most of the rest of us had growing up just trample a turkey how could you charles could you? John said he was going back to the auction yard to collect the money for those sheep. He'd be a damn idiot going anywhere near that town right now. Uh, he reckoned he'd be able to slip in and out. Oh, well. If it's John's idea, it must be a good one. Careful. What is it with you and him? Oh, uh, he disappeared on us for a while. <laughs> Hold up. Let me check this. carry on along this trail so I was saying when Jack was real young a long while a year ago, he did and we was family you know I guess I still ain't fully forgiven him for that there's a camp up ahead be careful seems deserted Let's take a look. I don't think I've ever done this mission not at night time. Whoa! Where is this guy? Uh, I don't know. But you know something? This is a better camp spot than back there. Much easier to defend. Maybe. Hello. This looks like our feather, Charles. Quick, cut him free and let's get out of here. Vorsicht, Vorsicht! Da ist eine Pfanne Vorsicht! Hey, Kammer! Three coming right at us! You! Get the hell away from here! Why the hell you drag us into this 
Charles. Oh, okay. Okay, getting you out of here. Vielen Dank für Ihre Hilfe. Yeah, okay. Hey, you wait there a second. Charles, go find Dutch. Get the caravan to divert here. This spot should work for us. I agree. All right, come on. I'll take you back to your family. Also soll ich mitkommen? Yeah. Here we go. Wo bringen Sie mich hin? What the hell did you do to those fellers? Wie bitte? Those men back there, why did they take you? Geld, money. Meiner Familie gehört eine Goldmine. Sie wollen Lösegeld erpressen. How did someone even come up with them words? Sie bringen mich zu meiner Familie? Vielen Dank. Wie haben Sie sie gefunden? Uh, I'm sorry, friend. I can barely speak English. Yeah. There they are. Dem Herrgott sei Dank. Schatz. Ah. Andreas, Andreas, ich hab gedacht, du seist tot. Beinahe wär's so gewesen. Meine Lieblinge, meine Herz allerliebst. Oh, wie wunderbar. Oh. Sie sind ein großer Mann. Ja. Ein großer Mann. Ja, wirklich. Es ist ein Segen, dass Thanks. wir sie getroffen haben. Come on, now get out of here. This place ain't safe. Get out of here! Ja, ja, Bam alles klar. Bam uh, ich hab was für Sie. Einen Moment. Uh, um, Thank you. Thank you. Vielen Dank, herzlichen Dank. Appreciate it. Pleasure. Yeah. I finally get paid for something. This place, oh, it'll be perfect for us. Hello, Arthur. Dutch. <clears throat> Miss Grimshaw, Mr. Pearson, put everyone to work. Make this place a home. Well, I don't know where the hell we are, but we are going to make the best of it. Gotta get a haircut again. in and up down here my daddy died in the field in pennsylvania fighting this lot i ever tell you that many times i see i'm boring you arthur worrying me we lost men back there we have lofty goals arthur we're trying to reform society to a kinder truer better way now of course there's gonna be casualties we're thieves. You know, the world don't want us no more. We? 
are dreamers in an ever duller world of facts. Now I'll give you that, but come on. It's nice out. It's nice out. Old Jose says that there's a trick around here. I reckon it's full of fish. Now this is my favorite mission in the entire game. It is so good because I get to fish. We're going fishing. Sorry, you know. Sorry about that. Fish here is a whole lake of them because I need to get out for a bit. Me and the old guard, before any of them back there, oh, there was a us. The curious couple and our unruly son. It feels good here. You did well finding that spot, Arthur. Hello, Cad. It's like I can breathe again, thick and soupy as this air is. Woke up, wanted to play Red Dead, so I'm streaming. I didn't want to do any off-camera things. I didn't really need to. Feels like a lifetime ago. It was a lifetime ago. But what a life we have lived, how well we have fought, especially both of you. I hope so. But now, when things are desperate, well, on on stream things, because I was planning on um going out and just getting a bunch of money. So I can like speed run it even faster, but ideas, you know. You. But I need you with me, not against me. Both of you, of course. Still, we do need money. I'm just probably gonna do everything on stream. Especially in the local town. After Valentine, I want everyone on best behavior here. No trouble. But start turning over the soil. Every Rocks. single detail. See what turns up. Every single thing that I do. Imagine what a slew of rich, simple tins there must be down here. Oh, this is perfect for you, Hosea. You'll be able to play them like a fiddle. Nothing would give me greater pleasure, but no. Yeah, this is the best mission in the entire game. I'm telling you, I get to fish. Looks like law up ahead. Playing cool. And also do this, but more importantly, fishing. Hello, gentlemen. I mean, fish seem kind of food-like. I see. Well, well, look who it is. Quiet back there. Let's see if we can't sort this out. How are you, boys? Fine. This is quite some country you have here. We like it well enough. Hoagie McIntosh, at your service. Lee Gray. This is my deputy, Archibald McGregor. It's good to meet you. You a Scot? Partly. The best part. <laughs> of course. Yeah. Now, tell me, sir. What almost, silly, fancy back there almost do? as bad as Mike. Nothing too terrible, I trust. He was accused of running a gold mining investment scam. Oh no, 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 no! I'm sure he Hang on. wasn't. I want to see the mustache again. I know him. He's a fool. Yeah. But he's not a bad <laughs> fellow. Now, can we 
Can we just... I wouldn't do that if I were you! I... Shit! I... The Anderson boys! I can't have more scandal! Well, allow us to help, my friend. Arthur! Not more scandal. Man, uh, and, and take Archibald with you. Just what I signed up for. Come on, big guy. Perhaps we can discuss the foolish magician. Let's go after that train. Keep your guns holstered. We need them Anderson boys alive. And then this Come train on, is going to go All right. really on, fast. All of a sudden. Faster. Come on. What's your name, sir? Arthur. Arthur Callahan. Faster, Mr. Callahan, please. My neck is on the line here. I get it. I'm doing my best. Uh, looks like the son of a bitch is going to make it. You sure I can't just shoot him? No. Did I not say that? You said plenty. Come on. Look at you two fellas all cuddled up. <laughs> Let's go. Come on. All right. I was waiting for that. Idiot. Now get after the others. Come on. The train is slowing down to go through the station. Now's our chance. Get to the side of the train. Cut through that barn. What the hell is going on? Get in closer. See the flat carriage? Head for that. Get us as close as you can. You think you can jump on there? Watch out, he's throwing bombs at us. No, I went far with that. <laughs> Spring heel <old> Jack. <laughs> yeah, you really stopped me with that one. See you. Drop the knife. Drop it. Drop it. I'm just gonna spam B. Thank you. Hello? Is everything all right in there? Well, I don't think he's dead. I think I won the fight. Oh, just about. Oh. It's really unfortunate you put your hand in there. Bring him out here. Can you open the door more? It sounded like quite a commotion. Is that him? I sincerely hope so. Old Anders Anderson. Yeah. I don't I don't come on. Either you didn't um do the little command to add your birthday, or the bot didn't work, which it doesn't sometimes, but no problem. Take him to Sheriff Gray. There you go. You are a natural. All right, let's take him in. Follow me. What about the others? Oh, we'll round them up. Anders back there is the brains of the operation, and that's really saying something. You're the boss. That was mighty impressive, sir. I have to admit. I'd hazard a guess you've served the law yourself. It's yeah, I wouldn't say the well, law. I wouldn't exactly say that. Are you familiar with the area here? No, not really. On your right here, these tobacco fields? This is part of Caliga Hall, big estate belonging to the Gray family. Looks bone dry. 
Yes, we are in dire need of some rain yeah. right here, let me tell you. The Greys have lived in Caliga Hall for generations. Today I was the birthday bot. I've been working for them for years. Sheriff Gray's the one I know best, of course, but they own half the businesses in town. Which town? Rhodes, sir. You don't know it? Where we're headed right one now. One of the better towns, in my it opinion. The war, I like, but it I like its charms. I'm sure you already know of the Braithwaites. Like I said, just got down here. Another big family in these parts. They have an estate west of here. Awful people, truly awful. They've been fighting with the Greys for as long as I can remember. <laughs> Sounds like quite the place you got here. It's a really there. small Look horse. There left here. Saloon owned by the Gray family. We also have a general store, gunsmith, post office, train station, of course. Oh, good, they're back. And that's your friend, right? Yep. Okay, we're gonna stop just ahead on the right outside the sheriff's office. Can you grab Anders off your horse and carry him in for me? All right. Just bring him here. Hey, fellas. Hello. Mr. Gray! We got him. Very good. I told you Arthur would deliver. Oh, it's Man that kid. For justice. That's wonderful. So, uh, about my friend here? Your idiot friend is free to go. But no more trouble from you, partner. I promise you this was all just a big misunderstanding. However, I want to thank you from the bottom of my heart. Now, I'll pretend to appreciate that. Mr. McIntosh, it has been a real pleasure. The mostly good citizens of Rhodes, we welcome you. Well, we're just honored to be here. And make your friend a behave. Huge mustache. We got enough trouble from some of the residents, old timers who've gone sadly to seed and lost their dignity. How terrible. Come along now. I will keep this fellow on the straight and narrow. Well, come back and see us sometime soon. Excuse me, gentlemen. Hello? These better be ugly rooms. Is it true you were seen talking to that wretched Penelope Braithwaite? I can't thank you enough. Where have you been? Around. And where are you staying? I'm renting. Caravan. On the edge of town, behind the church. It's horrible, but no one comes looking. The whole town's trapped in this interminable <sighs> feud between the two families. His lot, Gray's, Braithwaite's. <sighs> Interesting. Two old plantation houses falling out. Rebel gold, marrying cousins, not marrying. Arthur, That's Jose, you start poking around, see what you can find out about that. I have missed you, boys. I've heard about bounty. Oh, there's been a price on my head for 13 years. It'll take a month to find us down here, and it seems like we can have a little sport. Well, they're good bounties. Where you hear this? Some fellas I met at a camp near the state line said there was talk of it in bars uh, in the north the... and west for 500 miles. There was talk of super agents. Some super agents. <laughs> I'd love to meet one. It's just talk. I'm sure it is, but I could not tell you. Stay out of trouble. Thank you. Okay, so these two plantation families. Arthur, you start sniffing around the Gray's place, see what the story is. Yeah. There. Yeah. Uh, I passed by it earlier with our friend Archibald. Good. Hosea, you see what you can find out about these Braithwaites. I figured. Anyway. Fishing or no fishing? There's still time. I'm up for it. How about you, Arthur? Have you had enough of the chase for one day? Okay. Sure, why not? Great. Hosea, 
Why don't you lead us to that spot you were talking about? I kind of like this place. Okay. Let's see if we can avoid any more excitement. Gentlemen, follow me. There. All right. So how far is this creek? It's a bit of a rock. Here comes Pete Gaming. And it's not a creek. It's the same lake we camped on, just a different pipe. It'll be worth it. I saw some big drum and sturgeon there. Should be rock bass, bluegills, perch. Pickerel, too. It's a good spot. We'll see if you're as good at catching fish as you are at catching criminals, Arthur. I'm gonna catch more fish than both of you combined. I'm telling you. But his information is good. Plus, we are now ingratiated with the local law. I'd say it was a worthwhile diversion all around. Trelawney's like a bad penny. I'm not sure how good a magician he is. But he's certainly good at disappearing when he feels like it. Where does he go? Everywhere and nowhere, it seems. We wouldn't have got Sean back if he hadn't been weaseling around down that way, though. Hey, Dutch, remember that time you found him in the outhouse? <laughs> oh, yeah. We hadn't seen him in weeks. We stopped in some dead-end town in the middle of nowhere. Don't even remember the name. You and Bill were off doing something, Arthur. <laughs> so, we pick up some supplies. I go to relieve myself, open the door, and there's Trelawney, sitting there, newspaper in hand. Mr. Vanderlyn, I say, what the hell are you doing here? And he said, I could ask you the same thing. Now, if you wouldn't mind giving me a little privacy, I ate a rotten oyster. <laughs> hey, maybe there are actually a hundred. I'm gonna to catch them. literally everything. Terrible thought. Uh, so what Trelawney said about those bounty hunters. What do you think? I told you. It's a part of the game to catch after me for years. ungodly amounts of fish didn't have a price on my at an unreasonable pace. Now, Dutch. Super agents. That's just Trelawney over egging the pudding like the showman he is. Unless there's a new breed of special man I don't know about. This is the spot. Down to the left there. I saw some boats around last time. Be good to get to deeper water. Yes, over there on the shore. I'm sure nobody would mind if we borrowed one of these. Come on. This looks like a fine vessel. Okay. Come on, Arthur. Let's get her in the water. Huh? Oh, oh. I got a good feeling about fishing here. It's supposed to be some incredible sturgeon. Oh. Okay, here we go. Here we go. <sighs> Pushing the boat like that? You boys are too old for real labor no more. <laughs> You're too dumb for anything else. Crime splinters. <laughs> That's suck. Too quick for me, old man. 
I mean, there's a whole other two boats right there. I don't, I don't think they, I don't think they mind. It'd be fine. really come here at dawn or dusk that's when you catch the best fish we should use a lake lure that'll give us a much better chance of hooking something big like a sturgeon strong with good old worm oh worms are good for tiddlers like bluegill and rock bass but you'd have to be real lucky to catch a sturgeon with one lures it is then you heard the expert archer let's bait up Keep the lure moving slowly on the water so it looks like a little fish just asking to be eaten. It looks like you got a bite, Arthur. Yeah. Fish on the line, Arthur. I I have horrible handwriting. Like I I cannot write at all. Something's nibbling. And I'm all I'm all I don't I don't, I don't think I'm that smart. But you know, horrible handwriting. Well done. Not bad. He's also not hey, too dumb. Remember that time we sent Arthur out fishing? He came back with three beautiful bass. Not this again. I don't think I do. Oh yeah, you do. He was maybe 20. 21, walked in all full of himself. We had a big feast. Toasted him all night. This was 15 years ago. Oh, I remember now. <laughs> then, the next week, Arthur and I are at the market, and Fishmonger calls out, So how did you enjoy those bass? <laughs> Look, you can fish, or you can go drinking all day, rob someone, and buy some fish. There we go. <laughs> hey, look at this beauty. There you go. Well done, Arthur. They can grow a lot bigger than that. Mm. Told me once saw a monster lake I want help. The mouth of the river, just southwest of Saint Denis. Fifty pounder, he reckoned. <laughs> I would like to see that. There, hook them. I'm gonna keep throwing them back. I want health XP. Back in the day, Wesley, his name was. Real miserable bastard, but he loved to fish. We go out all the time. But one day we were river fishing. When we see a funeral procession going over the bridge, and out of the blue, Wesley stands up, takes off his hat, bows his head. Then he sits down, picks his rod back up, and carries on. Doesn't say a word. So I'm a little surprised and say, Wesley, that was nice of you. And he replies, well, felt I had to. After all, I was married to her for 30 years. <laughs> oh, there he is. Oh, dear God. Right. Uh, swim to shore. Remember those big salmon I caught in Montana last year? We had a banquet planned that night. As soon as all the dialogue is done. You never had control of that dog. Uh, yeah, had some spirit though. I'm gonna stop. Never lost the puppy in him. Right to the end. You know, I remember us saying how Blackwater was the furthest east we'd ever been. A as a group, I mean. Feels like the more we try to head west, the further east we end up. We had all those safe spots picked out to lie low in New Austin. Wow, nice There's one, Jose. That's so good. There. Still open and wild the way it should be. Somehow the desert makes you feel closer to the sky. No point us trying to get back that way anytime soon. Pinkertons have patrols out all over tall trees and great plains. We saw when we went back for Sean. Well, look at us now, huh? It could be worse. Plans change. That's just how life goes. Did I ever tell you my mother's buried in Blackwater? Really? She is? Apparently so. I, I only found out from an uncle of mine years later. Last I knew, she was still outside Philadelphia. 
I left home at 15 and didn't see her again. She and I didn't always see eye to eye. I wasn't always a very obedient child. I can only imagine. Still, I loved her in my Man. own way. You guys and suck at fishing. In hers, <laughs> somehow, even from the grave, she managed to have the last laugh. Got a nibble there, Arthur. Okay, I think I think I think that's it. After this one, I'm gonna stop. Nicely done, Arthur. That feels like a bite. Ha! Got ya. Well, I'll let you get that. Never mind. Hey, I reckon we call it a day, fellas. Already? You ain't been chasing down. You guys suck at fishing. It's sad, really. All right. Think we got a decent haul here. Pearson will be happy. Should we head back? We could keep the boat. Not too far back to camp from here. Good idea. Could be useful. Wow. We'll really, just boat. stole someone's boat. They'll find their way back. Just follow the shore south, Arthur. That was fun. Uh -huh. Thank you, boys. Now, Hosea. Yes. How about a song? Okay. Uh, Here we go. All right, I got one for you. I asked that gal to give me some. I asked that gal to give me some. She says, wait till the taters is done. I couldn't wait till the tears was done. I couldn't wait till the tears was done. Threw her on the floor and I knocked off some. I wish to God I'd passed her. All right. I I I am sorry. Tears got burned and so did I. That was that was pretty. I was tired. Also, simply can't sing. Best mission. Is it Jack? Yeah. Imagine seeing the three most influential people of the group just doing this. Just riding up. All right. I think I. Well, I mean, we are gonna be okay. I know. Well, uh. Know. Whenever I got. I hate by my side. how you had a point there, be just but fine. that is not true. Simply untrue. This place will be good for us. For now, anyway. I hope so. Also, little, little funny thing that happens, I never see this boat ever again. It does not exist after this.
What do you want? Just a, just a few bucks. I'm sure. Okay. How are you enjoying yourself here? Well enough, I guess. And you? Well, it turns out the pursuit of freedom is not a cheap business. Not for us, and not for some of the locals. Sharking already. I prefer to call it banking. You ain't the one handing out the beatings. No, but I am the one feeding the women and children in the camp. What mm. choice do we have, Mr. Morgan? I don't know. Are you? Come on, man. Tell me who. Here's the list. Refinery worker turned hunter by the name of Vinton Holmes. I Your feel like I'm doing more, actually. Ah, an apprentice undertaker. This one working in rows. His name was... Gwen Hughes. And how many of them do you think will be able to pay? <laughs> With enough encouragement, both of them. <laughs> yeah, I still hate that guy. Anyway. Uh. Okay, I could play. <laughs> I wanted to mention that. Um. Okay, I'll do this mission. Say whatever you damn well please, but I tell you, if I don't get out of here soon, I'm gonna kill somebody. And if you don't stop hissing at me, I'm gonna kill you. You come near me, sailor, and I'll slice you up. You put that knife down, or you're gonna be missing a hand. What is wrong with you two? I ain't chopping vegetables for a living. Oh, I'm sorry, madam. Was there insufficient feathers in your pillow? I ain't lazy, Mr. Morgan. I'll work, but not this. Well, I ain't cooking work. Why is the food floating? My husband and I, we shared the work. All of it. I was out in the fields. I can hunt, carry a knife, or use a gun. But I tell you, you keep me here, I'll skin this fat old coot and serve him for dinner! Watch your damn mouth, you crazy goddamn fishwife! <laughs> Enough! Both of you! <laughs> Well, come with me then. Uh, you wanna head out there? Run with the man? So be it. But we do more than just hunting. We're hunted. And them things hunting us, well, they got guns of their own. I ain't afraid of dying. Good. You need anything, Mr. Pearson? Maybe me and Mrs. Adder. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, sure. I'm list. gonna play an Arthur. Can you post for me <laughs> while you're there? Sure. Come on, princess. Are you coming with me then, woman? <sighs> Sounds like one of his plans. From chopping vegetables to shopping. Shut your goddamn mouth. Looks like my horse. You cool down then yet? I guess. Can I go faster? Please. I am dying of hunger. Where's that letter? No. Oh, robbing and killing's okay, but letter reading's where we draw the line. Here. Dear Aunt Kathy, you are some. I haven't heard from you in some time. Yep, there's so the I health. Pray to the Lord above that your health has not deteriorated further. Blah blah blah. It's boring. Ooh. <laughs> Wait a sec. Boring. Listen to this. Since we last corresponded, I have traveled widely, making there we go. Okay, speed. <laughs> Before you ask, I am still yet to take a wife, but I can assure you it's not for a lack of suitors. <laughs> he ever actually even talked to a woman he ain't paid for? Oh, look. 
We're all hiding behind something. <laughs> and what's this? Return to Tacitus Kilgore. Oh, that. Now that's Dutch's idea. All males be sent to the same alias. Whenever we set up somewhere new, Strauss, he heads into town. Tells them to start expecting mail from a Tacitus Kilgore, whatever they changed it to. <sighs> Here, give me that back. We got work to do. <laughs> okay. Um, here we are. So, what's the plan? I shoot the shopkeeper while you. No! Are you insane? Well, I thought we was outlaws. Outlaws. Not idiots. We rob fools that rob other people. Oh, yeah. These people are just trying to get by. So you head on in there. I had to Google him for one second, and then I saw his face immediately. I'm like, yeah. It'll be time for killing soon enough. What are you doing? I'm gonna go check the mail. Nothing exciting. Now I can eat food because I'm dying. <laughs> okay, there we go. Yes, I would like to post a letter. All right. Hello. I'm also gonna do a bit of that. Okay. No trouble. Thank you. Bye now. That's the word in Doesn't. Yeah. Hello. True, but yeah. He's good for Joel, though. Sister's newborn had more strength than you, and he came out brat blue. I'm trying. Try harder. Hello. Am I supposed to get on this, or what am I doing? I think this is everything. Thanks. Okay. Here. Take that for yourself, okay? Thanks. Well, give it back then. Jesus. I didn't ask for his goddamn help. Hold on your damn hat or the gust Why don't you it. drive? Okay. Come on, lady. Get a move on. I like... Oh, yeah. Hang on. I know. It was like 3 a.m. when I checked it. And it had like... I think so. It had a lot. Hold on. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, it did. I wasn't some little wife with a flower in her hair baking cherry pies all day. Yeah, I don't doubt that. You sure look the part now. Won't be long before you're smoking cigars and playing the harmonica. I'll have you know. I used to love yeah. playing the harmonica before. Well, it's always the birthday tweets. Everything I own got burned to the ground. Because of Micah. I'm it's all because of Micah. About what you, uh, you know. Maybe I'll keep my eye out for another one. I don't want no pity. Mm. Just treat me equal and no. Nobody's taking nothing from me ever again. Mm -hmm. Just don't kill the camp cook. Thanks, Micah. You burnt everything. Hey there. Oh, hi. What, uh, what you folks up to? Just heading home. You're in Lemoyne Raider country. I don't cool. care. You pay a toll to pass through here. No, I don't think so. You don't think so? How about you pull over right now? Pull over? That's what I said. Hey, how's about this? No. Go, go, go! God damn it! Oh, okay. Get me. What the hell was that? It was gonna rock. That's a valid reason to shoot someone. Pants, think you're landing, Ricky. Ah. <laughs> I'm gonna run this 
I'm just gonna turn that away. <laughs> Get shot. Alright, you're done. I am so sorry. Sorry, I, I, I'm look. I'm looking at Discord. Hold on, Sadie. Jeez. Trash gang. Don't you go ribbon Pearson about that letter. How dare you? I wouldn't dream of it. Right, you wouldn't. I have traveled widely, making no small name for myself. I won't be giving you no mail to post anytime soon, that's for sure. <laughs> I just want to peek in that journal of yours. The mind of balls. Not a chance. I forgot. That the journal is a lot. Then, Not quite. <laughs> well, I'd like to say I missed your fine conversations, but I'd be lying. I, I enjoyed myself out there. Yes, we, uh, Mrs. Adler did okay. At shopping? Yes, at shopping. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Don't mention it. I would ride with you again, Mrs. Adler, if you will ride with me. Maybe. <laughs> if you prove you can handle yourself. Well. They say I lack finesse, but I ain't afraid of gun smoke. <laughs> we got this, Arthur. You've already done me a big favor today. Okay, Miss High and Mighty. Anyway. Ooh. Oh, shut up. I'm gonna rob a house. Oh, hey, Arthur. Here. Yeah. So, tell me, is your people, uh, Jacobites or English lovers, Arthur? My people were peasants. We had no time for politics. My because that no politics was politics. money. Oh, well, bullshit, That's it ain't got no place here. Why? Because there ain't no judgment here. Most folks hate the Negroes, they hate the Redskins, the Jews, even us Irish. <laughs> you ain't so free of politics. I hate everyone just the same. Well... In that case, you're gonna want what I just found for us. What's that? I was riding around a couple of days back. I come across this old cabin. A couple of fuckers lazing about outside all liquored up. <laughs> I didn't think nothing of it. But then I come across this hunter down by the river. He tells me they're a stick-up crew. Says they hit a train a couple of days back near Emerald Ranch. Nice fella he was. Shared a bottle he did. Then I robbed the bastard blind. <laughs> you believed him? No reason not to. If he's right. It'll be a big haul for us. We saw three of them, maybe more, but I reckon you and me, we could take them real easy. All right. Easy. What the hell? Let's go check it out. <laughs> Damn sons of bitches. Think they're mean? <laughs> they're about to get a lesson in mean. How did my horse get there? You just keep your cool, you hear me? Get up. Right, follow me. I'm going. How far is this place? It's a bit of a ride, not too bad. 
Back up north to stretch. Not far from the state line. All right. Hmm. So, what were you doing riding around up there anyway? Sniffing around, looking for the tape. I mean... We got a lot of nose for these things. Dutch has always honored us to get out there and bring in money, ain't he? Yeah, right, <laughs> so. I ain't like some of them others back there. Sitting around <laughs> waiting to be told, I go after it. I Spelled that exact way. I mean, I don't need no coddling like the rest. Dutch knows my value. Also, the name Michael. Sucks. Tried to kill him, if I remember the story right. And he kept me around, didn't he? He saw something in me. He said as much. I'm sure. But Sean? Sean's great. Also, the character is great. I like Sean. You are clear on how this works. We split half. Other half goes to the gang. No. My name Let's isn't Michael. All our savings hidden in a safe spot outside camp. I just hate. I I just don't like the name Michael. I thought you said your name is Michael. I I mixed up your your message for a second. Camp funds, supplies. My name is not Michael. <laughs> in fact, you don't know that. Suggests you clearly ain't put much in it. But always pay me way. Don't you worry. You're sure you scoped this place out right? Yes. See? That's why I wanted you along for this. You're still a doubter. I ain't just some dumb kid. I've lived a doubter. lifetime of shit already. And you sure don't keep it bottled up inside. What about that train job with the oil wagon? Made a good show in there, didn't I? Yeah, you killed about two you people. Knocked out. Ah, also that. You to remember. We got paid. We got out of there. Got knocked out in Blackwater too, didn't you? <laughs> now that was bloody chaos. Did you get split off with Mac? Nope, didn't see him. We lost your boys at some point when he was getting out of town. They caught up with Mac a couple of days after. Davy was finished by the time we got up the mountains. Jenny didn't even make it that far. Those bounty hunters strung me up, beat me, pulled teeth, burned me feet. I didn't breathe a word about nothing. I swear. Good. And it's time folks stop giving Dutch a hard time about all that Blackwater business, if you ask me. The man's not a fortune teller. You can plan, you can use your head. But you never really know what you're walking into. Yep. Folks always want to blame someone when things go wrong. I hate how everything just how turns... Are we there not yet? Better be worth it. Everything just turns green, even the, like, the air. Like, the fog up there is green. Get it. The clouds. Oh, okay. Hey! Give me just my shotgun. There we go. Here, I'll deal with them. Let's make sure we keep one of them alive to tell us where they stashed the money. Hope you know what you're doing. Huh? Oh. Look, there's one on the outside. This is good. It is. Leave it to me. I'll do the talking. You hang back. Hang on, I gotta go with the with the game's stereotype and pull out my binoculars to see something that I can easily see. So needed. Hey there. Oh. Oh. I want to give you about five seconds to get the hell off my property, boy. Uh, look, don't 
want no trouble. Just thought you might like to know we passed six poxy alarm and head up this way. Now it does look coming up east. What? Where? Right here. It's the marker. Here come the rest of them. There's a lot of you living in this one house. We got more coming out of the woods. Come out with your hands up. Nice and easy. You saw what we did to your pals here. Okay, okay, I give up. Don't you. I ain't armed. If you want to leave, you'll tell me where that money's stashed. Well, all right, all right, take it easy. Behind the, the wall in the bedrooms, if you stick your hand between the gap. All right, you go grab the money. I'll keep an eye on sunshine here. Go. Get out of here and never come back. All right. Ooh. Is that a gun up there? I found a place, didn't I? All right, here. But don't forget to give the camp its share. That's a whole three bucks. Magic, you know. All right, don't need to lecture again. I'll see you back at camp. You never know what folks got stashed. <laughs> Just got a few other places out there. Like Is there? Oh, there's a crate under here. What is this? Guess I have two of them now. Cool. Now I can dual wield fast shooting pistols. No, I can't. Man. Alright. Give me that and give me this. This one. Uh, what? What is that? Yep. I'm actually curious. I don't think I've seen this before. No, I've seen this. I'm going away. I am so sorry. There, girl. Yeah, you're all right.
Hang on, I keep looking back, and I just keep reading... I just keep reading that. Anyway, sorry. Yeah. Um, I'm gonna buy some camp stuff. We have the whole twelve dollars collectively. I'm, I'm just going to upgrade these. No, that, 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 that I, I, my name is not Michael. No. <laughs> I'd be very angry at my parents if my parents called me Michael. I'd be upset. Okay, no. No, I, I prefer Eck. No. Actually, I don't prefer Ek. Ek is horrible, but that's worse. Mission time. I see Mike over there. I want to bully him. <laughs> no, I, I, I just hate the name Michael. For no good reason. Just what is your game? You're one to talk. You creepy, no good bastard. What's your problem with me? You don't fool me one bit. You'll keep. Okay. That's what I wanted to do. And I'm 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 gonna do missions now. And through here. Yeah, good girl. How close am I to bonding four? Uh, not close. 
us at all. Did... Excuse me. Alright. Go that salt with. Good day. <laughs> I mean, Jake isn't. Jake's a good name. I didn't expect me to... I didn't expect to trample like I... I didn't expect it to work so well. <laughs> of course, of course. Oh, and here is my dear friend, Arthur Callahan. Boy Hello. is a hunter. Boy is a killer. Here he is, just absolutely drunk Mr. off his mind. Oh. I'm so sorry, Sheriff. Well, how are you doing, sir? I'm fine. Tough business you boys had. We did? Well, there's no need to pretend with me, sir. Life can be tough. So it can. And no man owes another anything. No, sir. But still, I feel you were hard done by. Losing your employment like that? But still, here in Rhodes, <laughs> we have Look work enough for thinking. honest men. <laughs> Oh, that's some strong stuff. Still, don't seem to be doing you any harm. Again. Back in the day when shotgun shells were brass, not plastic. I told you we was moving up in this world. Deputies. You have finally <laughs> lost your mind. Amongst these drunkards, hillbillies, and slavers? Good honest thieves like us. We're bound to be moralizers in a place like this. Oh, Sheriff Gray, you are back. Now listen, sir. There is shine in them woods, though. And it is cost yeah. in this county its good name. And the state a whole lot of income. You boys wouldn't mind rooting it out. Maybe we'll make you permanent. I gotta set me down a second. Not a problem, sir. Not a problem at yeah, all. Yeah, you should take you a in cold shower. Now. You are and people waste time with the temperance movement. Liquor never dull. Takes more things. alcohol. All right. You know what? Good for you. With the deputy. Bill and I will follow. Climb on up. Good. Go. Good for you, guy. Archibald. How are you? Pretty good. And your friend is behaving himself. Oh, uh, yes. Uh, I think he's learned his lesson. Yeah. Congratulations on becoming a temporarily deputized citizen of Scarlet Meadows County. Uh, Most uh, towns just get bounty hunters to do their dirty work these days, but I don't see what's wrong with bounty hunters. The law. Now, I'm sure I don't need to remind you there's a chain of command here. There is? Dang straight there is. This is a dangerous business, but follow my lead and you'll be just fine. Sure. Hey! Archibald wants to remind us he's in charge here. Oh, that... Of course! Who else the fence is right there. I have things to sell. Them, it's fine. Boys, and I put in a very good word with the sheriff on your behalf. We appreciate that. We rounded up the other... Not a very good look for the sheriff to be absolutely... Like blackout drunk in his office right now. Not just any Drinking moonshine, by the way. I told you about the Braithwaites. Pretty sure you did. Old Cotton family had a fortune at one point until, well, a few changes in the labor laws. Now they're dealing in moonshine. We found their stills hidden all over Lemoyne. The quickest we destroy one, another one pops up. You could call it a pitiful fall from grace, if they had any grace to start with. I have no time for tax dodgers. 
tax tax dodgers has a rather interest in thoroughbred horses to maintain but i heard something about it being gold these families were fighting over well that's the rumor but the greys and the braithwaites think the other stole the fortune from them but it happened so long ago i don't know for sure if it's true must be tough being yeah rich, huh? <laughs> so i imagine that oh, French names. Suits you, Mr. W. It really doesn't. I thought so too. Does it feel good to be back at it, serving your country? I wouldn't go that far. Whoa! Whoa! Hold up. I can see that badge from here. Ugh. Yeah. Friend, ew. Ew. <laughs> Dear me, that don't look good. Oh. Come on, mister. This guy looking blue. Keep your eyes open. Now he's looking red. Alright. No. Oh. This must have happened recently. Hey, come have a look at this. He died, he died, died. Suit and tie. Rest in One peace. Bullet clean through the forehead. Well, my money says this uh, is the I, of It the looks like a lot more race. than one bullet. Yeah, Just saying, there's a lot of blood. Let's see if everywhere else. Okay. We should get going. I'll send someone Dude. over here later to clean this up. These damn flies! I swear they got it in for me. You could try washing once in a while. Oh my god. Let's what am I doing? There's nothing more we can do here. Uh, am I supposed to get on? Okay. Wasn't letting me. Oh. Bad mistake. Meow. Okay. Frederick Mitchell. Lemoyne State Legislator. Poor fella. Hey, hey, not so fast. I'm going faster, actually. Despite you. Yes, smacks of the Raiders to me. Bunch of ex army free staters without an ounce of respect for the law. Go right at the crossroads. Yep. I passed it. They're right again here. Mm -hmm. oh, and I know the Braithwaites are in business with them. No, easy. We ain't in that much of a hurry. Trash. I'm in a hurry. Trash, my uncle Reginald used to say. He had a few stories, let me tell you. Town preacher and town sheriff. All right, nice story. Sailor under the table before breakfast. Here we are. So what was I saying? Something about the Braithwaite, I think. My gun. Saying that word makes I have my me gun. sick. Now, anyone we find here, we bring in alive. Understood? Round them up, then take this operation down for good. Come on. Let's see what we're dealing with. <laughs> I I think I was able to drift See, another coach at one point. I said this place was crawling with vermin, and we just found ourselves the rat's nest par excellence, as they say in Paris. My aunt, she went to Paris back and I don't care. This. Well, the way I said actually let my friend here decide. He doesn't have your fine way with words, but he is definitely the man for the job. Let's split up. Arthur and Bill, me and Archibald. You boys want right or left? I've never taken right, right, so... Let's stop these filthy, we'll degenerate tax dodgers. The cheek of them. A fine idea. Hush. 
Remember what he said. We need them alive. Let's just knock them out and then tie them up. Got it, Deputy Williamson. We won't catch the rider. Grab the other fella. You are deaf, my good sir. Deaf. Damn. Someone's coming. Stay out of sight. Anthony. His face is in the dirt. Right. Let's gather them up. Anthony. Explosives? Yep. Sure. Anyone but him. So. Make it real funny, don't you? Tell me about that. <laughs> that is the last time I'll mention it, I swear. Yeah. Oh, thanks for the eight dynamite. Cool. <gasps> I expect an animation. They've been here. Oh god. <gasps> I killed horse. I am so I am so sorry. No, <laughs> I killed two. I'm sorry. <laughs> right. Oh, hi. and get out of here. I'm sorry. Come by me. Arthur Morgan, the marathon runner. return to our lives ah seems like we failed to destroy the last of the moonshine sure would you like us to well, i normally take it for personal consumption it's sort of part of the job 
But I better get back home. Why don't I just take a jug or two and leave you boys the rest to show that there's no hard feelings on account of the war? We are all Americans. Of course. My cousin, Webster. He used to say some of us is not as American as others, if you know what I mean. Only I didn't, quite. Come on, you degenerate, no good, white trash, hillbilly piece of scum. I know you, Billy Lime. Wow. You Billy Lime. Come on, move. We have a life move on a land so stupid, a backwater so backwards that even we are like geniuses. <laughs> Bill, get this stuff out of here. Come on, you ride with me. Okay. Should I stash this somewhere near camp, boss? Yes, show it to Hosea. I'm sure he can find a use for it. Bit of trouble back there, Arthur? Ain't there always? Not good. From what they was yelling, I think they were the buyers. Old Archibald didn't ask too many questions, so fox. neither should we. I ain't planning to. That was worth the effort, though. Deputized and hiding in plain sight. These lawmen, these two families. I mean, I really think we can play this from all sides. It's got Hosea written all over it. This is starting to sound like the young Dutch again. What do you mean, young Dutch? I'm as strong as I have ever been. Hey, you Frog. Know what? Why don't I race you back? All right, prepare okay. to lose, idiot. You're on. That's the spirit. Okay. On my word. Set. Go. I'm gonna cheat. I'm already ahead of you. There we go. You never were much of a rider. You're behind me. Actually getting worryingly close. Dog. You're slow. Get better at riding a horse. Dutch, it, it, it's sad, really. You know. I don't want to say anything, but you're bad. Kind of a skill issue. And... Drift. I never knew you were quite so good at running away. I never knew age had slowed you down quite so much. <laughs> well, time is a bastard. When you get to be my age, well, you'll know that better than anything. Be well. I had fun with you today. You're... I was gonna say you're like a son to me. But you're more than that. Can't wait for you to like Maiko more. Sorry, I'm done. Hey, Arthur. Can, can I have a quick yes, word? Yes, Yeah. Ah, call me Molly, would you? Oh. Arthur, how is Dutch? 
I mean, how does he seem to you? I'm about the same as usual, I guess. <laughs> you really love him, you know. But if he... Like he always says... Loyalty he always comes back. So. Arthur! Excuse me, Miss O'Shea. Arthur! I bring a gift. A great gift of information. So you got some tip-off. So now I can yeah. risk my neck and make you some money while you lounge around. You know, Arthur... I'm just gonna check to see if I have something. Just a just a little thing enabled. Alright. Bitterness, it, it works on the inside as well as on your sour face. If you say so, but you could go find some other fool to run your errands. Bill, come on over here. Will you be my other fool? You too, Charles. What are you talking about? Arthur's above a little stick-up I heard about. No, I'm not. You just said. Hey, I'll do it. As long as you ride with us. <laughs> well, I got a serious medical condition. <laughs> yes. You are a compulsive liar. No need to be like that. Charles, have I ever lied to you? I hardly know you. Exactly. Now, you boys should do this. It, it's easy, and I'll only take a small commission for my information. But it's now or never. Then it's never. Oh, God help me. Fine. I'll do it. <laughs> well, what is it? It's a supply wagon carrying payroll, but very briefly unguarded, apparently. As it passes through a crossroads near here where there's an old ruined church, before it connects with the rest of the wagon train, very easy picking. As long as we get paid or you get shot, I'm happy. You are a sick man, Arthur Morgan. I've never seen this guy in my life. Come on then, you miserable bastards. Also, this was the mission I this wasn't the mission I thought it would be. Um I will be back in just a moment. I'll be right back. Back. Down here all of five minutes. <laughs> well, you boys went off fishing or playing Aww. lawman or whatever the hell you've been doing. I've been getting down to business. <laughs> Finding the nearest grog house. Hey, if you don't want in on this, Williamson, that's fine by me. Do us all a favor. Head home. Just give it a rest, you two. Just have a little faith for once, will you? Now, I've been scoping jobs like this since you fellers were knee high to a grasshopper. Once a decade, maybe. So what is it you scoped here exactly? Well, I told you. There's a wagon with a lockbox passes through every week. 
They switch outriders just north of here, but the front wagon's by itself for a stretch before the last run down in the road. <laughs> I I've been watching them. Okay, hold up here. We should cover our faces. Are you kidding me? It's right here. Up ahead. When Lumbago. Soon, Williamson. Christ's sakes. I should be due any time now. Let's keep this quiet. This is so close. Nobody needs to die here. There. You see, gentlemen? <laughs> Just like clockwork. <laughs> I don't, I don't want to get shot, but this is a mistake. I work for Cornwall Kerosene and Tar, Mr. Leviticus Cornwall. Oh, great. So you know him? <laughs> Who doesn't? I hear he's rich enough to share the wealth around and not miss it too much. Oh, he'll miss it. Okay, we're looking good. Must be nearly a thousand. Really? Hey! Think I see something! Oh, uh, great. Let's go! Arthur, let's go! Yeah! Oh my god. I am into the woods. Let's shake him and get back to camp. No, we need to find a place to lie low. We can't risk leading Cornwall's men to camp. All right. Oh. Whoa, Whoa. Let's, let's, let's hide in here. Quick. Whoa. Okay, give me my give me my shotgun, please. Yeah, <gasps> Thank you. you All right. Actually, gave me the guns I wanted. Crazy. Stay until dark, and then we'll sneak out of here. Charles, you keep watch for now. Sure. Well, we uh, get some rest. Yeah. All right. I guess we're sleeping. All right. Let's try and get out of here. Hey, shit! Absolutely. Shut up, old man. Well, look, I was just trying to... Shut up. There's a light over by the house. Damn. Man, this is really, com I like, convenient. This just... Keep this calm. See what happens. <laughs> Kinda. And you didn't hear nothing? Still one of my favorite characters, though. Charles is amazing. Tell me what you heard. I don't... Maybe I heard some noises out by the barn. Ugh. Ain't me. Better not be. All right. Coop forth. Low. Go check out the...
Can I go in first person with this? Well, the place looks deserted enough. Sure. You head inside, I'll go around the back. How can they not see us? The old guy up there is full of crap. Dude! Don't see any horses. Boss! Place is empty! Oh, man. Jesus Christ. Oh. You know what? I'm gonna play first person. Stop the fire out, please. This is this, actually this. This is just unpleasant. Stop! Why am I so fast? Jesus Christ. Really? This is right here. Why are we hiding? Spelt different. Follow my lead. Bastard. Made a meal out of that, didn't you? Duh. This is a young man's game. We should go get my hand. All right, shotgun. Oh, 
Are you gonna get down from there? We all still alive. Yeah, just about. Yeah, I'll deal with you later. But we got some money, didn't we? Sure, but now we got Cornwall on our backs. It was again. an honest mistake. Hey, leave it, Quonk. Get out of here. Every man split up, Quonk. Run quick. Good luck, Johnson. Stay quiet and move. Hepatitis is cracked. Oh, that was a, like almost a thousand. <gasps> I want to do that mission. I'm going to do everything in my power to not do that GR mission because I hate it. It's a horrible mission. <laughs> I don't want to know what that was. Who's that? How'd you get back so fast? Jesus. <laughs> and his name Charles. Yeah, he's amazing. Definitely one of my. Uh, I don't know how high my list goes when it comes to favorite characters. There's a lot of good characters. So. I can go hunting with Charles right now. Should I do it? Cause I'm thinking I should. Yeah. I'm gonna eat this first. You switch that. Yeah. Good morning. Good morning. Really dropped the serving spoon on the mud. Great job, Arthur. And also dropped the dishes on the floor. I'm mad at Arthur now. Kofi. The best boy. Okay. Hey, Kane. <laughs> well, <laughs> what did Kane do? A real bad thing. So he never stopped wandering. Now we got a camp dog. Arthur, a dog, a dog. Yeah. Okay. Anyway, Charles. Let's go hunting. What you prepare for? 
Greatest of gifts. An unguarded stagecoach. No, you simple-minded fool. Bison. Bison? Bison. How much you Bison. can get anything? There's some over on the plains, I believe. I saw a couple a long way off. Oh. Right? Good luck. You want to come with me? I'll show you how we hunt one. Sure. Why not? Bison. Let's go. Oh, I just got what you said. All right. When you you type by son, and then I thought it was like a was Dutch thing because I I was right next to Dutch, but you know. Bison. Almost as one. The bison went, my people went. They were the center of all life. We couldn't survive without them. They provided us with everything: food, clothing, shelter, tools. There was a lot of respect. Huh. I don't remember much. My. I should. But I think my people. Well, we pretty much moved with the whiskey. <laughs> well, my father did that too. Curb key. So, where are we headed? Back up to the heartlands. Okay. Feels like there's been so much noise and chaos recently. Do you mind if we just rode and enjoy the silence for once? I need to clear my mind. Yeah. So, bye bye, mate. You good? I like his hair. <sighs> the fact that I knew that, and then you said it, and then it, gro it grossed me out, I, I hate it. that fact. Oh. Yeah. But when I figured out people, you know, cut the hooves, like trim down the hooves, that made me realize that they were toenails and that made me really uncomfortable.
over there. You see them? Oh. Great. Incredible, aren't they? We should only kill one of them. I'll keep them ringed in and you see if you can bring one down. Okay? Clean as you can. Okay. Yep. I don't have a good weapon for this. I just have a bow, so it's not gonna be like horribly clean. Sadly. Come on, please. I don't want to do this anymore. Stop. Oh, you're still alive. I'm s right. okay. I'm Get sorry. Take the horns too. Wait, you are you still alive? What? Why? Oh, okay. I thought it was still alive because on the map, if there's a paw mark and it's yellow, it's still alive. But this is a it's a quest marker. Okay, thank God. <laughs> Throw that on your horse and mount up. I wanna go check something out. Okay, let's go. Let's go, girl. Where are we going? I thought I saw some scavenger birds over here. I wanted to see what attracted them. Oh. I haven't done this in a while. Man. No. Look. Bison. Shot and left for dead, it looks like. Why would someone do that? I don't know. But I see tracks head. Why did Arthur sound sarcastic right fall. there? Alright. Lead the way. Alright. Let's go. shot I just don't know why anybody would just leave them here to rot like that <laughs> where's it <that> from <laughs> again but this one looks fresher there's a camp there I'm gonna take a look Also, fun fact with making fire with, like, stones around it, it's generally not a good idea because rocks can explode. Yeah. Because we are the repercussions. They could still be in the area. Let's get up higher, see if we spot anything. This way. We should have a good view from up here. Wow, what's over so thrilled? Okay. You see anything? You see some smoke to the east. Maybe another camp. What a look. All right. Yeah. Let's go. All right, we're going. Killing for fun. 
think we can talk? I don't kill for fun. I kill when I need to. Hmm. Better man than me. Look, more dead bison. It has to be them. Come on, wait up. This is the first time any NPC has started sprinting on their horse without it being a chase scene. My god. Did you fools shoot those bison? What's your problem? I said, did you fools shoot those bison? Calm down, you black or red bastard. Whatever wow. You are. Did you shoot them? Yes, we did. We shot them bison. We'll shoot you too if you don't get. What business is it of yours? What? We. No! Ah! It's that business of mine! Good God, you're crazy! I got a family. a family. Deserved. Don't shoot me. Stand back, Charles. I'll get you some answers. What the hell are you doing? Why are you <clears throat> killing those bison and leaving them to rot? I don't know what you're talking about. God damn it, tell us and you're dead. Oh, okay. We were paid to kill as many as we could and make it look like it was Indians. Just kill him, Arthur. No, please, don't <sighs> kill me. I'm begging you. All right, on. get out of here. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Do, is there like a picture of that? Hang on. Oh wait. It's fine. Don't, don't shoot me, mister. I got a family. Then run Get away. Why did you do that? He didn't need to die. Maybe he'll go tell his friends now what happens to poachers. I've seen enough of this. I'm heading back. Okay. I'm gonna see if there's anything worth taking from their camp. I'll catch up with you later. Oh, there's this chest right here. Ooh! That sounds horrible. Well, it doesn't sound bad. All right, girl. Um. It's just a, like, it's like. It's like three dots. So, yeah, I, I need to DM. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh my god. I thought I thought you meant like a mountain with some bison skulls on it. No, that is that is a mountain of bison skulls. Jesus Christ. <laughs> yeah, okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right, then. <laughs> um, go back to camp. I have a mission there. <laughs> Did 
didn't expect to see that. That's for sure. Oh hi, Jose. I see you've been taking good care of that horse. Jose. There's a fishing mission, but I don't really want to go fishing. I'm good. Room by the fire here, Mr. Morgan. Arthur. Arthur. Lanny! Come here, Lanny! Lanny! Arthur! Yes, kid. You got a lot on? Ah, uh, just hunting for all this hillbilly gold that Dutch and Hosea seem to think is out there just waiting to be stolen. <laughs> Why? I got something. Could be good. Yeah? Yeah, I was in Rhodes talking to some of the colored folk. They said there's a gang of fools holed up in the swamps east of here who think their war ain't never ended. The Civil War? Yeah, apparently it's still raging in these fools' minds 30 years later. Okay. That ain't my point. These ignorant fools are weapon dealers. And in their dealings, sometimes sit on a decent pile of cash. Yeah, been selling weapons to Cuba and South America for years. Anyway. Wow. I was talking I... to... Reckon there might I be blinked a bunch of cash for one second and around. almost missed that. Arthur, Maybe you serious? It's just a bunch of crazies, Gardner? Exactly. Well, I just wasted, like, beef jerky, whatever that was. Look at least, isn't it? That was my thinking. Said it was at some place called Shady Bear, deep in the woods. Okay. <laughs> Let's go. Rest in peace. Like, the whole cow had to die for that. And you just right, threw it on the floor. Let's go rob some food. Shaking my head. Hang on, I gotta go interrogate Micah real quick. You're welcome. Dang it. How much banking does one man need? I, I couldn't antagonize him. Okay. Every single second. Oh, I didn't sell the bison way? thing. You know what? Give me one second. I'm gonna I'm gonna put this down. No, get back here. Please, 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 please. Thank you. I'm gonna put this down. Where, where, please. Please. Stop walking slightly faster than me. these crazies before you've been drinking again no well yes but no that's not how I might have met them I think some of them harangued me and Sadie when we were coming back with supplies mrs. Adler yeah and mrs. Adler did just fine more than fine actually she's terrified but I know most <laughs> of these fellers is one and the same yeah, we won't find no shortage of angry Pecklewood idiots in the state of Lemoyne. That's for sure. Is it really that different in this state? We haven't come far. It seems like it is. These boys got a... So are these states? Hang on, sorry. These are states. Really? These are... So small. Anyway, but I haven't necessarily noticed. All respect, Mr. Morgan. You wouldn't notice. Might call you a nigger lover. They see us riding like this, but most of it is a a glance or a word. And after that, 
A visit in the night. Well, out west, it's... Out west is out west. And you're all who you are. Uh, decent folks. But some places down here, they judge differently. Oh, well, no. Guess it can't be so easy for you, Lenny. Sorry you're caught up in this. Well, I guess their gold's still shiny. And their guns still shoot. <laughs> so I'm game for robbing any and every one of these bastards for all they got. <laughs> okay, then. Plus, it beats being lynched back in Blackwater with all of you by my side. I guess it does. He's a great character. Okay, I have a lot of good, a lot of favorite characters. There's a lot of them. Feels like we're close. It's a rundown old plantation house down in the bayou somewhere. Let's take it slow. Be cautious. If, like you say, these crazies are sitting on weapons, we're gonna wanna strategize a little before getting shot at. <laughs> of course. They said fight the uh, old go. battlefield and keep on going. Well, we got some wrecked old Civil War weaponry. Now where are the wrecked old Civil War holdouts? See that church up ahead? They're supposed to use it as an outpost. Heard they got men going between here and the big house all day. Okay. Look at this field. <laughs> Imagine getting caught up in a fight like this. Yeah, I don't care to. But now we have technology with guns. Hold those. Do I have a better outfit? I do not. Brains in. Hot. Let's just. Uh, I, I'm Wait very sorry. I keep. Place. I hear you. Uh, it doesn't look like anyone's here. We don't know that for sure. But now they know we're here. Oh, another thing about Arthur. He can draw, like, landscapes super well. Look at that. Hey, you see something? Why are you stopping? Hear that? Someone's on the track. Look there, the wagon. Let's yeah, I see, see where it. He's going. You're on me now. Right behind. Let's hmm. Yeah, it looks red. Just too fast. Looks like explosives. Hey, that looks like dynamite in the back there. It looks like we're on to some. Red barrel equal explode. I think I see something. End of the avenue, between the trees. Might be it. Might be. Keep it steady. Oh, wait. Hold on. Nope. Hey. Big plantation house. <laughs> Must be Shady Bear. I reckon we can leave our mounts up there, off the trail. Good enough to me. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna check something real quick. Just, just give me one second. Check something.
Are we doing this? Oh, what, what am I doing? Come on. Uh, they made me pull out this gun. We can get a view on them from that wall up there. Bring your Absolutely right, not. Right? No. Take the other side. You get a <sighs> Please, please, please. Did you see anything? Yes. Okay, thank yes. God. Yes. Yes. Right. They're armed. Almost a militia. All right, some tents. They got men covering the house. I know dynamite crates when I see them. We got something, right? Oh, we got something. We can hit them head on, fight them honest. Or you could go down there acting friendly. Friendly? With these folks? Just draw them into one spot, then I'll start shooting. Well, that might be the dumbest idea I've ever heard. But hey, I'm always up for a performance. <laughs> go on in, kid. Give them both barrels of charm. Wouldn't try anything less. I can shoot those, right? Okay, good. Hello, Krabby. Today is a fine and fabulous day. I don't think the notification went out for Twitch. I don't know. Hello. What do you want? Praise be, my people. Praise be. <laughs> now, I come in peace to discuss the merits <laughs> of the story and interest you in eternity. <laughs> Praise be, my That's people. Sad. Praise be. Now, uh, are you? Uh, have you? Will you be saved, my brother? Praise be. Huh? <laughs> Alright. Sorry, Lenny. Diablo. Serpentine. You can't hit what you can't shoot. All right. Diablo. Any men in the area would have heard that. They might be on the way. Now let's grab something to get out. Sounds like a plan. Here. Come on. This is full of new rifles. We can sell those, right? We sure can. We'll check the rest later. Now, come on. Let's go. Let's go, let's go. Get this back to camp. Yep. Right. 
Coming our way. Keep it together here. Hey! Sean. It's good to have something to show like this. Sean's a loudmouth bragger. More about what Sean does. Hey, I like him, you know? Well, so do I. It's my better judgment. Just you worry about you. He wasn't on Leviticus Cornwall's train with me. We had to dig him out of Blackwater. But enough, but nothing. Me and Dutch, and everyone who counts. We know what you do for this gang. We notice. Keep it up. You're gonna start seeing things change for you. Okay then. Okay. Thank you, Arthur. Wholesome. in these trees up here. Let's get there. I like food, these. Right? I'm gonna keep one, just for me. Hey, I always enjoy riding with you, kid. <laughs> you know how to fight. Hey, you too. Anytime, Arthur. That is great. Do I not have food anymore? Okay, I'm just gonna eat. I want to talk to this guy. <laughs> what you want? You okay? <laughs> <laughs> Do I look okay? <laughs> no. You look awful. <clears throat> awful. Look at me. Uh, 
I wasn't born to this. I didn't deserve this. I used to be gentle. Jeremiah Compson. Compson stead. Good for you. If that's anything to boast about. They took everything from me. Who did? They. And what did they take? My whole life. A whole way of living a career. I stole a lot of things, but that's quite a lot to steal. Look at me here. Living in the shit and the mud. I'm sorry. <laughs> my old house. The house my grandfather built. It's all dilapidated and destroyed. Repossessed by the bank. I'm sorry to hear that. I was supposed to live a different life. Me too. If only. I could get my old things back. Personal I think she got really good hair. Watch. I'm gonna say that. Old pistol. My ledger. Where's this house again? Compson Stead. It's a, north of Scarlet Meadows. <laughs> Banks says I can't go near it. I'm living rough over by Aris Field. Well, if I'm ever out that way, I'll see what I can do. Time. Time is hell. All right. So. I've decided to do something. Just now. I am going to end and Raid Diablo. Because he's about to start or end his starting soon screen in 10 seconds. So I'm going to raid him. All right. Solid three hour stream. Had fun playing Red Dead. All right. Bye, Creppy. All right. Um, bye.